you all have had a great week welcome back to my channel if you are new here so glad that you clicked on this video i'm finishing up curling my hair because i'm about to head out the door i think i'm gonna run to target today and see what i can find i've just not been to target in a while and i'm having the urge to go so there might be a target haul later on in this video and i was thinking about getting my spring clothes out and switching them in my closet still have not decided if i want to do that today or not but it might happen and a cute entrance from mr neeson say hi this is neeson if you are new here he's our cat he is named after Liam Neeson. That's our favorite actor, so that's where his name came from. But I'm just touching my hair up right now. I use this T3 wand. I've used this for like three years now, I guess. I love it so much. Yeah, I'm just touching up some pieces around my face and head out the door. My hair is getting kind of long again, and I can't decide if I want to keep it this length or go a little shorter or grow it out again. I used to have hair down to like right here. I'll post a picture actually just so you all can see because I started my YouTube back up after I cut my hair. So you guys have never seen my hair long. And then I chopped it probably, it's grown about an inch. So it's grown quite a bit, but let me know in the comments. What do you think I should do? Should I keep it shorter or let it grow back to what it used to be? I'm kind of missing the long hair and with hats and everything it looks really good with shorter hair but I think that's all I'm gonna curl I'm literally just doing the front pieces I'm being lazy today just because I want to go ahead and head out the door but you can see I just gave it some texture I'm wearing this cute little cropped sweater it's actually part of the set I posted a picture on my Instagram today of this and it's super cute if you want to go check out my Instagram it's at Lindsay Brooke Mitchell and you can see where I got this from so yeah I think I'm about to pick up really quickly just our bedroom before I head out and go have a fun day at Target by myself that's the plan for this morning Albert just went to a golf lesson so I always film while he's at golf so y'all probably think he's always literally always golfing which he does golf a lot but he's not always golfing it just happens to be when i pick up my camera so that's where he's at today and i think we're gonna go to costco do some things when he's done later but i'm going to pick up real quick and get ready to go little green top that went with that set this is the necklace I wear all the time it says be the light I love it so much you can't see it in the mirror but it's really cute it's from Abel and these jeans I never wear but I pulled them out just because I don't ever wear them they're from Target the Wild Fable brand and then these are my white Converse and then I'm wearing my Abel backpack too so about to head out the door Let's go to Target. I just got back from Target and I didn't get too much. I just got some random stuff that I needed. Let me get this set up. Um, so I'll show you what I got because I like watching what people get at Target. It's interesting. First off, I got this. I tried, if you follow me on Instagram, I tried one of the other juices that had more like greens and stuff in it and it was not good, like at all. I had to like hold my nose to drink it, but I picked up this one. It has apple, banana, mango, lemon, and kale. And it is so good. Like if you want to try any green juices, start with this. Don't get the one with like collard greens and green chard and oh, it was bad. It was really bad, but this one's good. So I picked that up. Let's get off the table. Okay, first thing, I really didn't need any clothes, but this dress was $4. So 
thought why not it's just a little dress with a little sunflower on it i thought it'd be cute for like going into spring or even next fall i will just you know layer it and it'll be cute but for four dollars i couldn't pass that up so i had to get that i always get these two products from target i take my makeup off with this it's the all-in-one waterproof micellar water and then i use the my cat is in the target bag right now look at this you see what the heck are you doing oh my gosh okay you just play right there <laughs> he's like he just laid down in it such a weirdo anyway I get the rose petal toner from Dr. Thayer's, I think is how you say it. So I use both of these products like every day. So I like to stock up on those anytime I go. I also like to stock up on this. This kind, the cacao and cashew butter is the best granola I have ever had in my life. And I can only ever find it at Target. So every time I go to Target, I always pick up a bag because it's so good. If you haven't tried it, you need to. Um, let's see. I got, this is like Albert's favorite candy, so I picked him up some, and I got some of these Smart Sweets. I've tried the peach rings, but I've not tried these watermelon bites, so I picked these up just for a movie night tonight, and then this uh, dry shampoo, I use this every day pretty much too, so I always stock up on that. I got these Mighty Patches because... If you haven't noticed, I've got a situation going on <laughs> on my face, specifically my chin. So I used these, I got like a mini pack of these the other day and they actually worked really, really well. So I got a little bit bigger of a pack and I've tried a lot of patches like this, but this brand has by far been the best. They're a little pricey, but um, I think they're worth it and you you just put it on at night and sleep in it and then you take it off in the morning and it makes your the size of whatever you're putting it on is so much smaller by the morning time so really like these so I picked up some more of those and then I bought some Tylenol just because I needed Tylenol and then I picked up these two like recycled notebooks they were only $3.99 a piece but I thought they were super pretty. I needed one just for my personal life and then I got a second one um, for work notes and stuff like that. So these are really cute. They make me happy for spring. I think this is going to be my personal one. I really like the purple blue color but yeah that's pretty much all I got from Target. I think I decided that I am going to bring out my spring clothes so I'm um getting prepared for that. I think I'm going to make some lunch real fast and then get started on that. I've got to go in the garage and like, got to like look through all kinds of boxes to see where my clothes even are. I'm not sure exactly which boxes they're in. I need to do a better job of labeling everything, but yeah, I'm going to make something to eat real quick, finish drinking this green juice and get started on pulling out my spring clothes. <laughs> The boxes are way too heavy for me to carry up the stairs, so I have them right here. Neeson's already getting on top of them. Um, I think I'm going to go through everything down here. Yeah, I'm going to go through, just look at everything we have right now and see what I want to move up there. And then I have, I already have some, I'll show you when I go up, but for my winter clothes, I've already turned around some hangers that I know I want to go ahead and store. So I think it's it's warm today. It's supposed to be warm all week, so I think we're getting through the cold weather. So I don't really need too many sweaters. But yeah, let's get started on seeing what we have. <music> I just brought 
all of my clothes up. You can see them behind me. So the plan is to take all of the clothes out of my closet that I have the hangers turned around with, which I'll show you here in a second what I do. I keep my hangers turned when I know that I want to put it up eventually or if I haven't worn it in a while. So I'm going to pull the stuff and go ahead and put it in a box that I have the hangers turned with. And it's going to make it simple and I'll just use those hangers to then put these clothes in the closet. So if you have been watching my channel for a little bit, you know that I did a closet clean out really about a month ago. It was not that long ago. And it took me like half a day to clean out my closet. And my intention behind that video or just behind that day was to get rid of like the bulky sweaters and bulky things that I didn't want to store that I knew I wasn't going to wear again. So I wanted to get rid of a bunch of stuff before it came time to do my spring closet switch out. So that is what I'm about to do. So I'm going to show you how I have my hangers turned and then just pull all the stuff that... I want to put up and see what we have. So far, I mean, the closet clean out, it was good. But now, like, you can see some white hangers got mixed in. So, I'm going to try to fix that while I'm switching out some clothes. But you can see I've got some hangers turned. So, if I have them turned like this, I'm going to go ahead and pull. So, a lot of it is just sweaters and things I'm going to take out. And we're going to start there. <laughs> stuff out Ooh, my hair I'm sweaty and it's like sticking to my forehead um, I just finished getting all my sweaters out of the closet okay that's a little better I just went and grabbed Albert's kind of fall stuff that I need to put away so I'm gonna work on his stuff and then I'm gonna start hanging up all my spring stuff I'm really excited to organize and kind of color coat my closet again with more spring like colors it's gonna be so pretty so yeah I'm gonna Get his stuff from fall and winter gathered and then I need to go get another box for his stuff because I filled up a box with all my sweaters. So I'm gonna work on his real fast and then I'm gonna start hanging up everything. <music> done I did my stuff and Albert's stuff so we're ready for spring to get here I think it's coming hopefully it feels really good today and I think tomorrow is supposed to be really pretty I think we're actually gonna go downtown and walk around a little bit tomorrow so that'll be fun but yeah here's what I have I'll show you the finished product I filled up two big boxes and then I put all of our clothes in switched out all the hangers and I actually had leftover felt hanger. That means we didn't have as much stuff to put back in as what I took out. So that's always good. Room for new stuff <laughs> is how I see it. The two big boxes I filled up, that's all of my stuff. And then this is pretty much mine and some of Albert's, but our closet looks so much better. Again, I just love when I get to do this on the weekend. So I did all my tank tops up here, color coded and I have just some random shoes that I wear like a lot up there. Down here I did short sleeves and then some long sleeves and I color coded those. And then those are all my running shoes. I'm obsessed with Hoka's if you can't tell. Um, over here I kind of spaced out. I put all my coats and stuff back in there. So that section is just like a random section. So I try not to pay too much attention to that. But here I did 
some of my just lighter cardigans with shorts. I've got some skirts and pants here. And then I went into my dresses and I did them by sleeved dresses, color coded from white to darks. And then I did like my tank tops and then a few rompers back here. And then obviously our jeans and stuff are up there. And this is Albert's section. I did his just kind of casual shirts and then polos and like some golf stuff. And I left him out a few sweaters just in case he needs those. But yeah, I think it looks so much better. I'm so excited to wear spring clothes. They're so much brighter and colorful. So I'm super excited about this. All right, guys. So I think I'm going to end the video here. I'm worn out from doing that. That like took all my energy I had for the day. I think I'm gonna just hang out for the rest of the day. We're gonna run to Costco later, but I think I'm just gonna pick up and start my next week's vlog tomorrow while we're downtown. So be looking forward to that. We've not been downtown in forever, so we should have fun tomorrow. I'm really excited, but I hope y'all have a great week. Thank you all so much for watching and hopefully this inspires some of you to go ahead and pull out your spring clothes and do a little switch up. That just made me feel so much better and like lighter. If you were new here and this is the first video you've seen, please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content and don't forget to subscribe down below to see more. I post every Sunday afternoon, so there's new videos every week and I would love to have you join the family. So thanks again. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.